If you already have a folder somewhere else that you want to upload to the CNI tool, the procedure is very simple. Go to the folder, in other words, navigate to the folder that you want to upload. I'm in my H drive in my 1314 folder and I want to upload this beta club folder. So I'm going to right click on the folder and then I go to the selection that says send to compressed zipped folder and I click. That is going to create a zipped folder, which is very simple. Uh, it's compressed all the files within that folder in the same location that the original folder lived. So it is on my H drive in my 1314 folder. I now have a beta club folder, just a normal beta club folder that is right here. And then further on down the list, I have a Beta Club zipped folder and I know the difference between the two because this one has a little zipper on it and its file extension is .zip. To get it into this, the CNI tool, I go to my mini barbecue. I'm in the class I want to upload that folder to and I come over to Edit Course. I go down here to Site Resources and Manage Files again and then I'm going to put my folder out here under my content as one of my main folders. So I'm certain of which folder I'm putting it in. I would put it out in the main uh, directory tree, main directory level. Click Upload. I have to go find it. Again, if you're in Chrome, you can drag it here, but depending on the size of the file, it's just going to take a while. So I'm going to go to Upload and I'm going to go navigate to my file and find it. So it's in my H drive, it's 1314, it's in my, uh, at the bottom of this folder under betaclub.zip. I'm going to click on that zip folder and click open. I'm going to click save. And you'll notice that didn't take very long. It is now out in my uh, content folder. However, the zip folder is not really the one that I want to use. So I'm going to come to the zip folder and I'm going to click on the down arrow and I'm going to come down here and select unzip. When I unzip it, depending on the size of the file, it should create its own folder right here and now you're going to want to come to the zip file and get rid of it because I don't need two files. So I come in front of the zip folder, click in the little box, and I hit the trash can to delete it. Now if I open up that beta club folder, I see all of the documents that were included in that folder right there. So this is a great way to get your H drive over into the CNI tool so that you can have access to your H drive from anywhere at any time. However, let me caution you to make sure that it's going to be easier for you to find things here just as it is on your H drive if things are very neatly organized. Uh, you can upload your entire H drive there are no size limitations at this point. Whether that will come into play in the future, I don't know, but we have been told that yes, you can upload your entire H drive. But I would suggest that you get it organized into folders before you just start uploading things willy-nilly. And that's how you upload a folder onto your CNI tool.